Hello there. Today we're opening up Lost Abyss, the new Japanese set that just came out. We're looking for the altered Giratina. The odds of pulling it are like non-existent, but let's start opening some packs. Let's go. Really cool box art. I love it. On the side we have some of the art. I like the Samungus. I also like the Metagross. And over here, what do we have? We have like a Molga, Wailert, and Shift Tree. All right, let's check it out. I don't know if the packs all contain a hollow. So this is the pack card with Giratina, pretty cool. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Do you like it? I think it's pretty sick. Let's see what we can get from this first Japanese pack. Oh no, there, wait, different, no, no code. Let's move one to the front and we can start with Nutslip. This thing, Baldon, Flashender, and Metagross Hollow. Okay, yeah, probably there is a. I'm either really lucky or there's a guaranteed Hollow per pack. Most likely the guaranteed Hollow. I like this art. I think it's really cool. Check it out. Really nice. All right, let's do another one. Let's see what we can get from these. One to the front. And we have a crocodile, we have Drowsy, look at this illustration, this is really, really cool. And then we have Finneon, which always reminds me of Kyogre, and Porygon 2, followed by Lady. There is a full art trainer of this card, which I would love to pull, I think that would be really cool. I, she's probably the best full art trainer in this set. But let's move on to another pack, let's see what else we can get. These packs are impossible for me to open, but I will figure it out. One to the front. We have... Ooh, is this a Sunflora? I haven't seen one of these in ages. Glad to see that they're bringing back these Pokemon. We have an Araquanid, I think, Sandy Gas, and Cro... I, for I always forget the Crocodile's names. Uh, I love this one, though. Another Hollow. So it's not guaranteed because the lady was not holographic. Pretty cool, though. Really enjoying the art on these sets. I don't know how many packs we have in here. I think about 30. What else? Uh, really cool. Loving the art style. Ferrothorn, Vulpix, the Vulpix not wasn't that cool, and last we have, there's a gold card of this trainer, I don't want to find it, <laughs> come on Giratina, give me that altar, we gotta find it, one to the front, and we have Talonflame, Porygon, Shopad, love this illustration, absolutely beautiful, Emolga, and last, we have another trainer. This guy also has the full art. Another card that I do not want to find. <laughs> what will be in this one? What do you think about the format of the Japanese cards with like five cards in a pack? I really like it. It's a lot, there's a lot less bulk. I love this horsey. Ooh, with like the little, this is, oh, I love this one. Who, this is by, yeah, uh, Azako Ito. This is really cool. It's like stitched together. Love it. Halucha. All right. And Rotom V. This is pretty cool. I love the art style on this. And the holographic pattern actually does go well with this illustration, which is not something I say too often with these. Love it. All right. It was a bit of a slow start, but we're starting to get a little something something. Let's see what we can get in... Hey, in this one. Huh? One to the front. And what will we start with? A masked ghost trainer. This one. Ooh, Baneri. This is so cute. And Ninetales. This kind of reminds me. This is really Naruto like. I think it really gives you that Ninetail Fox. Is that what it was called? Really like it. And Dragapult. Hollow. I do not like this Pokemon all that much, but the card is okay. -ish. I like it. Another one. What can we get in this one? One to the front. We have a Porygon Z. Ooh, there was something back there. I like this illustration. And then we have another Flash in there, another Dragon, and uh, Perserker V. I don't like this one. <laughs> Terrible art. I don't think that's cool at all. Come on, we're at two Vs. There's gotta be something else that we can find in here. A little bit better than that. There's an incredible Aerodactyl Altar that would also look pretty sick if we could find it. Finneon. Oh, uh, no, wait, I messed it up. Luminion and Finneon. <laughs> 
I, I, it always reminds me of Kyogre. Venonat, Slugma, and Travenant. Pretty cool. I do like this eye. We have so many more left. I don't know if the Japanese boxes have a guaranteed pull rate. I think at least Mimikyu, I love this art. Beautiful card. I think you're guaranteed to have at least one secret rare C dot, Tynamo. I forgot the name of this one. And Amungus, the one that we saw featured on the box. Really cool. There are quite a few Giratina cards. I'm pretty sure there's like the V, V Star, gold versions of those. And then you have the Altar. Comfy, Fanfy. Ooh, Porygon 2. I do like the Cityscape in the back. Sunkern, love this one. I'm glad that they're bringing back like older Pokemon. And Bofalant. Also, is this like a representation of the antimatter thing that you can also see on the pack card? Could that be it? I don't know, but I really like it. I like this idea. Next up, we have some more things. Let's go. One to the front. Hypno, kidnapping people. Chinchou. Bird. Beldum. Ooh, trainer. She, I do not like at all. <laughs> I don't think that one has a full art, but if it does, that's the least one that I want to find. Anything but that. No, I'm kidding. Any, any, any full art trainer is always pretty cool. Let's go one to the front. We have Nazlif. Is this one Palosand? Araquanid, I think, Ferrothorn, and the uh, horse, the ice horse that I have never seen before. In what game is this? All right, one more. Let's go. One to the front, and what do we have? Another one with the little thingy of the antimatter. Barnacle, the dragon, Seedra. Oh, and that was it. <laughs> Terrible pack. I like it even more when they do fewer packs, but there's like a, a guaranteed uh, hollow. Moving over Palisand right there. One to the front. Dragon, Sandcastle, Porygon, Vulpix, and Delphox V. Another V. And this also has the antimatter theme. Really cool. So far, we got like three Vs, but no V stars. Will it be in here? Let's check this one out. Let's see if we can find it. One to the front. Ooh, this looks pretty sick. Love the lab with the with that barnacle. I think this was Araquanid. I don't know, I messed it up maybe. And Vulpix and ooh, V-Star, Drapion. Really cool. Look at that hollow pattern. This is sick. What else? What else can we get from these packs? Another Halucha. Let's go one to the front. Another stadium, our Halucha, Shuppet, Spinda! This is so cool! I love this illustration. This is lit. Check it out. Love this one. And a Pidgeot V. Alright, I didn't know that they that they brought Pidgeot back. Pretty cool. I think we're almost halfway through. My cargo. I'm really digging this theme. Indeedy. Little nothing. Ah, next. Can we pull the alt art? Come on, we've got to find it. One to the front. Another my cargo. Electric. Ski. Ski. Horsey. <laughs> Ski. Oh, nah, it always the ends with Ski. I hate that. What's your favorite card from this set? Are you enjoying the art style? I think they're really doing a great job with the artworks. Venomoth. Ooh, Seal. Another one that I've seen in Agents. Uh, Sandy Gas. Ooh, no. I thought for a moment we had a full art for some reason. I don't know. We gotta be coming up to something because we ain't finding anything. Anything. One to the front. We have the crocodile, we have the sandcastle, we- ooh, this is really cool. I love this one, Wilmer with the wingles. It reminds me of that area in Gen 3 where you save like uh, Pico and then uh, the guy brings you around with the boat. I really, really like this illustration. Drowsy and Venomoth. Man, we're getting to the end of this and we have still haven't pulled anything. 
I'm starting to like English better. I seem to be doing better with those. One to the front. What do we have? Cramorant, Beldum, Ninetales, Dynamo, and Shift Tree, Hollow. All right, it's pretty cool. I think we've found all the ones that were featured on the box art by now. We have seven more to go, which means we're zeroing in on the alt art or the secret rare. Hopefully it won't be one of the gold ones. Waylord, another really cool illustration. I think they did a very good job with the ones that are from older generations. Electros. Come on. Have you opened this set? Have you any luck with it? The trainer that we hate, the Porygon, the Seal, the Electric, and the horse uh, that Calyrex rides on. I forgot the name of this one. Really nice. Oh, so this would be the counterpart to the ice one that we found before. All right, come on, please be a cool alt art. That would be incredible. One to the front. Comfy. The stitch thing. Sunker. The one I don't know. And dugong. Still another really cool illustration. Let's see. All right, Lantern. Ooh, we have a Matang. This is beautiful. I love this one. Benary and Barn. Oh no, there was one <laughs> useless. Let's go. What can we get from this one? Buffalant, Fletchinder. We're Fletching, I don't know. Vanonat. The Ferrothorn uh, before stage and oh no, Stone Journer. Let's do a fusion strike. Let's change it up before the last three packs. Hopefully we'll be able to pull something from this one. Uh, uh, I'm not really sure. Here's the code. One, two, three, four. The front. I, I think I actually saw something. Swaddle, Skarmory, Jinx. Mantine, Grubbin, Gligar, and Gen- No! Oh my god! Yes! Yes! This is it! We finally found the altar! Yes! Oh my god, yes! Yes! This totally turns around the video! Lost Abyss doesn't even matter anymore! This is sick! Look at it! It is so cool! This card is so awesome! Technoblast 210! Look at this! It's also fairly decently centered love it yes yes i thought they would never come we would pull an art art from fusion strike yes wow we finally got one we finally woke up one guys can't believe it awesome yes fantastic pull all right now let's see if we can keep up the luck with this lost abyss pack okay go away look funny there was <gasps> nope <laughs> It was a Sableye. For a moment, I hoped that we had found something. But we only have two left, which means that it's in one of these two. I think. Because it has. We have to have to find something, right? Something in one of these. Will it be this one? Banette. Slugma. The crocodile, the seal, <gasps> Girat Giratina V Star. All right, this is cool. This is cool, but that means I am pretty sure that in this one there will be something amazing. The very last pack, triple rare, really cool. I do love the art of this card. Really sick. All right, this has got to be it. Come on, could it be an alt art? Could it be, I don't know, a full art trainer? I would rather find an alt art. As long as it's not one of the gold cards, because I don't think the gold cards are really good. What happens if we don't find anything? Is that a possibility? Could we, like, I like this dolphin. Come on. Moment of truth. It's something. It's something. Three, two, one. <gasps> yes! Yes! Oh my god, yes! We got the two alt arts! Oh yes, that is fantastic! Look at look at that pattern! Can you see it? 
This is so cool. Oh my god, and there's so many Pokemon making a cameo. That is fantastic. I love how there are also the trophies. Are the trees actual trees or are they like... No, no, I think those are actual farm trees. I, I thought that there were... Oh, there are also Ramparados over there. And Bass, to Banana. Yeah. I thought these were like Alolan Executors, but no. This is really cool. Man, I love this one. This is amazing. Two altars in one video. That is sick. Which one do you like the most, guys? Let me know in the comments. I actually really dig the Aerodactyl. It's, it's such a cool concept of it flying over the island with all those fossil Pokemon. And then you also have this one with the little Smergle in the background. Really cool, really cool. Really happy with this opening. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.